Chan, and this is Jason W. Chan's take. Today's story is an update on the whole Coco Lee saga. Nancy Lee, Coco's sister, issues statement via lawyer amid controversial recording alleging dispute with sister Coco Lee after funeral. So that's Coco, and I think that must be Carol Lee. A recording has recently circulated online, allegedly tarnishing the reputation of Nancy Lee, the older sister of the late Coco Lee, who passed away on the 5th of last month. The funeral took place on the 31st of last month, with the burial occurring on the 1st of this month. In the recording, Coco Lee can be heard in tears, accusing her sister Nancy of engaging in a dispute over a property matter. Coco claims that Nancy incessantly complains about the property Coco solely paid for, with the rent reaching six figures. <clears throat> well, that's an expensive rental property. Coco further alleges that Nancy constantly complains about how terrible the property is using derogatory language and asserts that Nancy has never contributed a penny. Oh, I see, so there is another recording. In response, Nancy Lee released a statement on Weibo, emphasizing that she has entrusted the law firm Nixon Peabody CWL to handle the matter and gather evidence in accordance with the law. She expressed her disappointment in the continuous spread of false information, malicious speculations, insults, and misleading comments, stating that such actions are absolutely unacceptable. Nancy mentioned in her statement, in this most difficult summer, we bid farewell to my beloved sister, and all that remains is sorrow and memories. I sincerely thank all our relatives, friends, and fans for accompanying her on her final journey in this world. I believe she can feel your love from the other side. I also hope that everyone can let go of their sadness, regain their laughter, and carry forward her ideals and wishes. Nancy revealed that whenever Coco faced setbacks and misunderstandings during her lifetime, she chose to face them with courage and overcome difficulties through her own efforts. As Coco's family, we deeply understand the hardships and sorrows involved. Now that Coco has left us, there are still people spreading false information. Okay, she said that already, I think. Wait, well, where, where am I now? <laughs> as a result, this is, this is getting misleading to me as well. As a result, Nancy Lee made two statements. The first is to immediately delete and s stop spreading false information, malicious speculations, insults, and misleading comments. So why the hell is she repeating herself three or four times? It's, this is getting annoying. <clears throat> anyway, this... I'm getting annoyed at this lady, Nancy Lee. She's getting more, less and less relevant now that her sister is dead. The famous one in the family is dead. She urged relevant online platforms to actively fulfill their supervisory obligations as network service providers by promptly blocking the aforementioned information and comments in order to prevent further damage. No, there's freedom of speech. Didn't she just say a few weeks ago that Hong Kongers have freedom of speech and now she's urging network providers, service providers, to block information. This, this is just, she's getting really annoying. This is just ridiculous. She also mentioned that she has entrusted a law firm to handle the matter and gather evidence. Yeah, I know, I know. Why is this article repeating itself needlessly over and over again? Good God. The second point is a plea to Coco's fans and the general public urging them not to believe or spread rumors in order to avoid being misled or exploited by malicious individuals. Regarding those who disseminate false information, she stated, I will use all legal means to protect myself and my family and pursue accountability to the end. I kindly request everyone to give Coco and our family the final care and respect. Anyway, what do you guys think? Is this lady annoying as hell? Is this, is this lady starting to get on someone else's nerves? On other people's nerves as well? Leave your comments below. This has been a Jason W. Chance take. Keep pursuing your dreams and passions.